time to make our trek through the undead burg. Now there's a couple of items in here. I'm just not sure I want to get all of them. So let's see. Whoa, bro. Jeez, guy just came right at me. I wasn't expecting him to be that fast. Hello, how are you doing? Let's see if I can make the jump. Oh, what? Come on, I know that there's a jump that you can make over here. Thank you. I don't really remember what the item in here is. Oh, humanity. Thank you very much for that. And what else can we get? I think we can get, like, um... I don't know exactly what the other item is in here. I, I mean, I haven't had to scavenge for a while, considering I've been doing New Game Plus with that. Whoa! What the hell are you doing in there, dude? Didn't you see me coming down? Didn't you see, like, a big picture of my ass all over your face? Oh, look at that. I'm sorry, can I help you, gentlemen? Oh. Banzai! Good night. See y'all later. Jesus, the character's already tanky as all hell. Let's get rid of this. Uh, oh, look at him. They're ju they were just hanging around, waiting for me. Hey, boys. What's happening in there? That's right, get closer, get closer, and goodbye. Get out of my face, man, thank you. Do, 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 do. Oh. What's in here? Oh, another body with another soul, thank you. You are far too kind, good sir. Oh, and there's absolutely nothing else in here. Okay, I guess I have to go back from where I came from. Fine, thank you, thank you very much. I haven't really came in this particular section in a while. It still looks pretty much the same as I last came here. Jesus, I have a big ass. <laughs> Look at that. Hey, it's not me, it's the ale. Where can a dwarf get some fine meat over here? And another soul, thank you very much. Uh, how do I get out of here, though? Did I just saw something in flames being thrown at me? Because I don't respond nicely to those kind of threats. I don't think that's nice at all. So let's go back up here one more time. Take a good shot of this big dwarven ass. If only my character could be a little bit smaller, it would be just perfect. It would be perfect would be perfection incarnate. In the meantime, we do have Mr. Grenades over here. Hello, Mr. Grenades. How you doing this fine evening? Goodbye. Whoa! What were you doing hiding in there, you little bitch? Did you know that this is a dwarven playthrough? Can't mess with a dwarf. Well, at least he already starts with the axe, because, I mean, an axe is technically still a dwarven weapon, as long as you don't start with a sword or anything. So I guess it was definitely a good choice of class if you want to roleplay a dwarf. Okay, so now let's get this done. Now the problem is going to be when I actually equip the dragon sword, but the, the drake sword is at least going to allow me to farm those dudes downstairs a lot faster, which then will probably allow me to get the mace that I want to begin with. And now it's time to greet the dragon. Hey dude. hanging in there. Now let's have a little chat with these individuals right here. Hello. Damn, they actually got me. They got me good too. Whoa. Keep forgetting this is no longer my main character and he's not as strong as my main character. Nope. Sorry about that. And sorry to you too, good sir. See you later. 
Now then, let's see what we can do about the Mr. Pesky Archer up here. Why would you want to do that? Why? I mean, come on. Can't you see? I'm a dwarf in a Spider-Man costume. I mean, what more tips do you actually need? I know that there's a wooden shield over here. I'm not sure if it's better than the one I have or not, so I just want to check it out and make sure. No, you're actually quite a lot worse. Blah. I don't even want to look at it anymore. I felt so dirty when I looked at that. Because it is a pretty terrible shield. Now, these, individual my, these individuals right here are a bit more defensive than we like. So, screw them. Just... Whoa, whoa! Jesus Christ. Not only he's um, defensive, he's also upset. There you go. That should fix you up real nicely. Thank you very much. Good night, goodbye, and see you later. Now I do believe we have an undead with an axe hiding in here. And good night. Oh, and now we have two battle axes. Yeah, that's perfect. Here's what we're going to do. There we go. That should fix things up nicely. Who needs a shield? Like a boss, well, just man. dual wield. I try. <laughs> <laughs> You're so funny, aren't you? Aren't you a little funny little bastard? Overcharging me for stuff. Oh, it's only 1,000 souls now? Isn't he a nice guy? I wonder... Yes, I do wonder. Well, I'm not really ready to shoot off the dragon's tail, so what I do need is... Let's just get this and get that residence key. Thank you kindly. <laughs> Who says I'm being kind? You need to shut the hell up before I break your goddamn face. And I will, because you know I will. Uh, Soul of the Lost and Dead, this is probably what gives us 200, right? Good, give me the key to the residence so that I can ah. save your stupid mage friend. Purchase item, residence key. Thank you very much. Oh. See you later. And what else was there in here? Oh yeah, this is probably the path that leads on to the crossbow. Am I correct? Maybe I'm mistaken. I don't really remember where this path lead. This path leads down to. Ooh. Yeah, dual wielding kind of blows. I should. I should really not have done that. Should really not try to be a hero. Damn it! Let's have a word with these fools. Get off of my way, please. Chop you both down to size, thank you very much. Who's up next? Damn it. I was hoping for my circular swing from the sword. Damn, you really get used to that great sword of Artorius. Or should I say, you really do get used to whatever ha weapon you happen to be using. You get used to those weapons fast. Which is obviously a bad thing, because when you find yourself with a different weapon with a different set of moves, you then begin to fail. Now then, let's not fail this jump. Thank you very much, and I do believe that if I go through here, I will get the crossbow that I was talking about. Which is still not good enough to shoot off the dragon's tail, but it is a ranged weapon that you get for free. Thank you very much. Can I actually equip that? Well, I don't really need it right now, so the hell with it. Uh, let's just go... I knew you couldn't climb through those stairs. I was like, what? There's stairs in here? I haven't done this in a while, that's for damn sure. Now then, we've pretty much purchased everything we needed from the merchant, so let's just take a quick rest so that we are now bound to the bonfire that's closer to the Taurus Demon. Let's get our asses going then. I should do a human playthrough though. That would be more fun for you guys. Thing is, I'm not sure I can afford it. I mean, I only really have two humanities. Well, three, I guess. Okay, let's put these humanities in here. Let's try to stay alive. And we'll take the usual thing, which is... If we find another player's uh, summoning sign, we will be forced to summon him. And if we're invaded, we'll be forced to fight. No running away, no nothing. Let's see what happens with that. 
Well, for starters, this is gonna happen, of course. This bastard's trying to nab me from behind. Die already. Just die. Just die in the misery. Wretch. Yeah, he is a wretch. Jesus. Oh, look. Whoa. Yeah, let's summon another player. Hey, hey. Actually, we can summon two of them. Sweet. Like I said, these are the rules. There is nothing I can do about it. Oh, looks like that one's already been summoned. So, did I get the summon? Did I not get the summon? This kind of annoys me in the multiplayer. It doesn't always work. Let's summon this one as well. We have a painter here. We have an artiste on stage. Yes, we did get the punk, punk rock lab rat. Jesus, he's got the paladin armor? Why is he asking for summonings in here? I mean, it's not like he's even part of the covenant for... What's his face? For the sun bro. He's not even a part of that covenant. So what the hell is he doing here? Oh, look, there's another one here. And that was a red one there. I'm just summoning the crap out of everyone. Okay, let's go. The red one seems to... Oh. He's here. Ah, must summon him. No, it actually doesn't work. Fine, whatever. Looks like we did get two summonings in, so this should be... Whoa, someone just invaded me. Oh, crap. And he's a big, mean pyromancer, dude. Jesus Christ, he almost just killed the guy that was with me. What the hell was up with that? What the hell just happened? I'm gonna kill you, you little bastard. What the hell is this? I have no idea what the hell's going on. I'm gonna kill this bastard. I'm gonna kill you, fool! Die! Oh, he parried me. Crap, how, how did this guy even invade me? Come on. That is crap right there. Oh man, I can't, I can't waste another humanity like this. I'm low on humanities. I promise I'll try to stay alive further up ahead. But goddamn, that was lame. Damn, he still hit me once. Oh look, we got one humanity, so now there's no excuses. Fine, whatever. I wonder why I did get one humanity. It doesn't really make a whole lot of sense, but... Okay, since we got one humanity, let's go ahead and let's do the whole reverse hollowing thing yet again. But I mean, come on, how did that guy had all of that gear? It didn't really make much sense. He probably had both the rings from Favor and the other thing. Let's have a little chat with this guy over here. See you later. Looks like there's no players to summon now. Whoa! Damn it, there's a red sign and the rules say I have to summon him. No? Is it gone? Okay, it seems to be gone, so whatever. Oh, my souls! I, I forgot about my souls completely. My souls are over here. Sweet. Now, dudes, y'all need to relax a little bit. Oh. What's up with that, Mr. Whatever Your Face is? Now you, back to back backstabbing. Like a boss. Thank you very much. Good night. Let's get ourselves some firebombs. Not that we really need them, they just happen to be there and I'm happening to be grabbing them. You, screw you, die. Still can't believe that guy had a plus 10... Um, well, not a plus 10. I mean, he... Well, yeah, he did plus 10 one weapon and then he enchanted it with lightning. And he was invading me. A level 11? That was messed up. That was bad messed up. Anyways, now we got the bombs. Let's see what else we can do here. I am going to be taking out the Black Knight that is in this area. Well, first I want to get rid of this guy. 
And this axe is really good for a starter weapon. Damn, the bandit is like the best melee starter, dude. Let's go up these stairs. Have a little chat with this individual right here. Good night. Miss me. So did you. So all of lost and dead. Thank you very much for that. And now that we have this, let's go ahead and take out the archer that's in the tower. I do want to get the resin, because I'm going to use the resin for the dark the dark demon, whatever, the Taurus demon. Uh, let's see, it's over here. Let's get that. Got to get rid of all those guys over there on the outside. Let's pray that I don't get invaded by the same, like, ridiculously over-the-top dude that in invaded me earlier. Whoa, what's up? Relax, man. I'm just here to help you or something random. Okay, what else we got? Whoa, you're already upstairs, huh? One of the spear guys. Okay. I see where this is going. Screw ya. Next up. Who's next up? Thank you. That's it. Come right at me. Oh, you didn't need to bring your friends. There you go. A little cleavage action, if I can say so myself. And everything down here is dead. I guess it's safe to pull out the uh, Black Knight. Dun -dun 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 Black Knight. I don't fear Black Knight. A long way from home. Deep Purple, guys. You guys gotta listen to Deep Purple. Deep Purple's the shiz right there. Whoa. Doesn't really do all that much. Whoa! I was about to say he doesn't do all that much damage, but I guess he does, bastard. Okay, Mr. Badass Black Knight. Come at me. Let's let's head over here to the arena. Where we can have a little chit-chat. Because I'm going to need some room to work around your ass for a couple of hours. Come on, come at me. To think I used to be really frightened of these guys. Whoa! Maybe I still should. Maybe I still should. There we go. There's the backstab. And there's the indication that this is going to take a while. And we're running out of battery. Oh, man. The, the clock is ticking, guys. The clock is ticking. Crap. Get over here. I'm sorry. Was there something I could do for you? I'm going to drink a potion if you don't mind. Is that okay with you? You cool? You cool, brah? Are you cool? You're not cool? Okay. So tell me a little bit about your frustrations. How was your day? How was your day? Oh, you got backstabbed with an axe? That kind of hurt? That's that's the sum of your day? Don't worry about it. Whoa! I got cocky. You see what happens when you get cocky? You get owned. That's what happens when you get cocky. Wow, a Titanite chunk. What the hell am I going to do with that at the level I'm in? Thanks a lot, bro. You could have left your sword or your shield or something useful. No, you had to leave a Titanite chunk. Ooh, potions. Thank you. Thank you very much for kindling that fire over there. That's going to come in handy. Let's go ahead and equip this ring. It's the only ring we have so far, but it is a pretty sweet one. It's a pretty decent starter ring. No, I will more than likely be replacing it further up ahead. Let's see about these dude, this dude over here. Come on, dude. Throw that stuff. Nobody left a message there. Oh, I forgot to buy the message uh, soapstone. That's crap. Good night. Why would someone go down there? It's a pain in the ass to get out of there. You couldn't convince me to go down there. Screw that. <clears throat> Should I go kill Havel? Man, this stuff would sure come in handy. Should I? The thing is, I'm in human form, so someone can invade me at any time. And if they invade me during the Havel fight, it will just make it that, more, that much more interesting, won't it? So let's see what's Havel got on us. Havel, I don't think you got shit on me. And I'm about to find out the hard way. Man, coming at Havel with no gear like this, it's like suicide. But then again, 
It will probably provide for some nice entertainment. Jesus Christ, I didn't even touch his health. Oh my god, this fight could take a while. This fight could take a while indeed. Come on, Havel, you're gonna have to make the first moves here. I'm definitely not gonna be the one to make them. It's the spin around. Everybody spins until their heads fall off. Jesus, 46 damage? That's pathetic, even for me. Nope, sorry. You're gonna have to go down slowly but surely, Havel, because I need that ring. That is a great starter ring, now that I think about it, actually, considering that it will increase the type of armor that I'm gonna be able to use. So yeah, Havel, sorry man, I really have to apologize, but I do need that ring. Jesus Christ, it rapes my stamina one hit. Oh, the guy is hitting me with a goddamn dragon tooth. What, what did I expect? Man, this is gonna take a while. You guys should probably go grab a soda or something. I'll try to be done by the time you guys get back. Come on, Havel. Look at him. He's just waiting for me. He's like, come on, show me a hole in your guard. I'll shove this friggin' dragon tooth up your ass. There you go, Havel. Here's some more of that stuff that I gave you earlier. But I guess you can take it. Whoa, 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 whoa. Gotta be really careful about those missed backstabs. Looks like you missed me yet again, Havel. And another backstab to boot. Looks like this is definitely gonna be taking a while. Relax, Havel, just relax, and it won't hurt as much, I promise you. I got some um, Vaseline in here, got some sandpaper too, so it's gonna be whichever way you prefer it. You want the Vaseline or the sandpaper, buddy? Yeah, I figured you for a sandpaper kind of guy, wearing all that armor and all. You're like, I'll take the sandpaper, you son of a bitch. That's fine, that's fine, we'll just, we'll be here. We'll be here, Havel. Don't you worry about that. I'm gonna be here all week bashing on you from behind. Jesus Christ. You know, the, the funny part about this fight is that I miss just one of these backstabs and he just rapes my face. That's what happens. And I know that you guys are just watching like, come on, Rukan, miss that backstab. Miss that fucking backstab. Get hit by that dragon tooth to the face. Dragon Tooth's gonna should be called a teeth breaker or the teeth rattler. It's gonna bust up my face, bust up all my teeth. Uh oh. You see him just looking at me, he's like, what the hell was that? Did you just hit me in the face? Did you? And I was like, yep, I hit you in the face, bitch. What you gonna do about it? You're gonna be mad and then you're gonna get backstabbed. That's what you're gonna do. And I realize that I'm playing it really safe. If you look at my playstyle right now, it's like as safe as it can possibly be. Taking absolutely no chances. That's because, remember what I said, I can get invaded at any point. I only have four Estus Flasks and I do have 3,000 souls on me, which for this much of a low level, it is still pretty significant. Come on, Havel. What you got? What you got, Havel? Huh, what you got, boy? Come on, attack me already, you bastard. Fine, you won't do it? I'll do it. There. Huh? How's that? Oh, I got him pissed off and all riled up. Ooh, slowly grinding away at Havel. What is up, Havel? We should be casting this as a sport event. And Havel misses again, and Rurikon scores like a boss he is. Look at you, Havel. Look at your ass. On the ground, like a little bitch. Whoa! You almost got me there. You tricked me. You went one way, and then you strike stroke on the other one, huh? How's about this backstabbing? How's about this backstabbing? Let's finish this. Whoa! You're still alive? He is still alive, ladies and gentlemen, and he's still going at it. He's grabbing his dragon tooth with all of his might. All of his might. Will it be enough? Come on. Come on, Havel. What you got? You missed me yet again, and here comes the backstab. Well, it wasn't really a backstab because I missed it, but still smacked your face in, so it's like whatever. Now let's get this. Thank you very much, Havel. That will come in handy. I love that ring. Thank you. Come on, guys. You got to thank Havel for that. I mean, come on. You can't just take the man's ring and be like, yeah, peace out. Screw you, Havel. Never really loved you anyway. Come on. Uh, now we got the resin right here, and this is what we're going to need. We're going to need this resin when we get to the Taurus Demon. 
I'm not really sure how to apply the resin, in all honesty. Like, the, the proper timing to do it for the Taurus Demon. But I'm about to find out. Is it here that the rat is? No, there's no rat here. The, the rat is in the other floor. Your rat is in another castle. Thank you very much for that. Whew, for a second there, I thought that someone was invading me and I couldn't cross the fog. It almost really, really scared me. Almost, not quite. Oh, what's up with this firing squad? To boot? Really? No, thanks, I'll pass. Pass on the firing squad. I will take the side order of french fries. Now then, let's have a word with this so-called demon. I do believe that a proper timing to apply this should be right about now. And I hope I'm right, because I'm only going to get one shot at this. Here he comes. Here he comes. That's what she said. <laughs> no, not really. That's not as funny as it actually sounded. Oh, you upset there, bro? Don't you worry about a thing. I'll fix it right up. Oh, tell me how much that hurt, please. Not that I really give a crap, but... Oh crap, he actually hit me with that? Jesus. Man, if he hits me again, I'm so dead. Don't do the jumping attack. No, 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 no. Crap, he still hit me. Bastard. I'm coming, dude. I'm coming. Just keep looking up. There you go. Do we have one more in us? I do believe we do. Crap, he's jumping in after me. He's getting dangerous. He's getting mad. He's getting furious. Damn it, he hit me again. Crap, I'm dead. I'm dead. I'm so dead. No! There we go. Come on, come on. Don't you dare hit me while I'm in the leathers. Don't you friggin' dare. Oh my god, he missed me. Good, 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 good. We're looking sharp, we're looking sharp. You guys have to remember, it is still pretty much an adrenaline rush. There we go. That should fix you right up, brother. Three leap attacks to boot, and you are down, good sir. Thank you very much for that. Wish you would have left some loot behind, but I guess you didn't. You bastard, you stingy bastard. We are now at 9,000 souls. Which is not where you want to be for this particular portion of the game, but we are going to be changing our equipment here. You guys probably already know why. Oh gee, I wonder why Rurikon's changing his equipment. Well, because there's going to be a friggin' dragon breathing fire on top of us pretty soon. And if I'm not mistaken, I believe that fire is unavoidable. I'm just breaking barrels because I don't remember if there's actually anything useful in here or not. And I'm just praying to God that I don't get invaded, because having to run all this way again would be a pain in my ass. Okay, now let's have a quick little word with Solaire. Good old sun bro, never, see, never fails to deliver. Blah, 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 bloody, 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 blah. Okay, give me the white soapstone. Oh, I... Yes, thank I... you. In a... so... Yes. It pleases me. We are Thank you. The vet, there's no but you to standing, of course. But yes, everyone's you. pretty much seen this, especially the part about the jolly cooperation. Okay, good. You keep admiring the sun, you friggin' drug individual. And I'm going to make a run for it. And a dragon's going to appear, and the dragon's going to burn you all to a motherfucking crisp. But since we had the fire shield, it wasn't as painful for us as it was for them. I can assure you that much. Thank you, and now I do believe we can go on ahead and kick this thing down. Yeah, I would try kicking if you didn't put a goddamn message in there. It makes it hard to even for me to even go down the friggin' stairs. Oh, come on, are you kidding me? Thank you, Jesus. 
And I know I can toggle by using the triangle. It's just annoying when people put, like, messages in those places. Anyways, let's see. We already got the dexterity we wanted. So I would say let's get some vitality juiced up, some more strength in there. And um, a little bit more of endurance and another extra point of strength just for good... Um, for good measure because I do believe that the weapon that we want requires like 26 strength or something like that doesn't really matter because I'm going to be leveling strength like bastards pretty much what's gonna happen throughout this playthrough it's gonna be strength 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 